from a global standpoint, India has always been a very strong performer for the initiative network. Uh, we've seen that again in 2011. Uh, Linda Souza and her team have done an excellent job uh, building the business up. Obviously, there was the disappointment of the ITC decision, but Linda's done a great job with her team uh, building the business back up, and it remains uh, one of the strongest agencies, uh, not only in India, but in our network. So uh, that's great news for us. I know uh, we continue to examine uh, and develop diversified resources, really the areas of content, uh, outdoor, uh, mobile and digital channels in general uh, has been something that Lynn's been focusing on and we continue to see uh, good uh, growth there uh, in, in the market and um, no reason why that should change. For 2012, um, what do we expect to see uh, from uh, our partners uh, in India? Um, clearly, we're looking at forecasts that suggest that uh, growth in the market overall could be uh, 8, 10, 12 percent. Um, so that's a great opportunity. There are some uh, business reviews coming up that we intend to take full part in and uh, hope to build our business further. Um, we're looking for uh, more collaboration with outside partners uh, and across our group and uh, also many opportunities to collaborate and tap into lots of things that we've developed in the initiative network uh, but also in media brands in general. So the initiative network has uh, connections panels which now number 200,000 people online around the world that we can tap into to better understand and faster understand some of the trends and insights that are out there. So uh, the Indian team has every access to that. Uh, an example from the media brands world um, is the, the lab, the IPG Media Lab, which we've just um, recreated in New York, which has uh, got great accolades. We've had um, two very big clients in there from the Initiative Network and we've had great feedback. Um, the, what goes with the, the physical lab is what we call the virtual lab and uh, this is available to anybody anywhere in the world in the Initiative Network um, on their desks. Basically the, the virtual lab allows us to um, vet emerging companies, um, in, particularly in the digital space, and to help our people around the world understand what those companies do how to uh, uh, interrelate with them, how much their services cost, what their services can do for clients. And it's really a response to the fact that we've seen such dramatic growth uh, in innovation in emerging companies that we've done something, A, to help people understand those companies and bring them to their clients, and B, to make that information very accessible uh, on everybody's uh, desktop computer. So think of it as a wiki. Um, for emerging media companies. So two examples of what we can do to help the Indian market grow further and add more value uh, to the clients that we have there. So we're looking for a, a super successful 2012, uh, lots of growth in the ad market in general as we know, uh, but lots of exciting developments that we believe um, uh, LMG will be uh, right at the heart of.